I want to kiss you and love you so much, even though you're kind of scary and missing an eye. You're probably wondering if dogs love kissing. Well, the answer is depending on the dog, some will, some won't. But this is why there's a difference between different dogs and what they actually think kissing is. I'm Dr. Ryan, a veterinarian and a veterinary behavior residency graduate. I love kissing dogs, but not all dogs love me kissing them. That's also true about women. Not all of them like me kissing them, and I really don't understand why. Before making this video or now watching, I searched the literature to see if there are actually any studies trying to understand what dogs think or if they like it or dislike it, and I didn't find anything. The only things I found about dogs and kissing was that if you kiss your dog, you're probably at a higher risk of getting all kinds of parasites and bacteria. That of course makes sense because dogs lick their own butts and lick their fur and eat all kinds of disgusting things outside sometimes. So if you kiss them, not even if you kiss their mouth, but you know, they lick their entire body, so they lick their butt, then the rest of their body, you know. So be aware that there is some danger kissing your dog. But that's actually not the only danger. There is also danger that your dog dislikes the kissing and might bite you. And I actually saw a lot of cases like that. In the end, dogs are not people and what we think is nice and pleasant, they might not think. You need to look at the dog and you need to get your face closer to the dog, right? Not all dogs like it. It might actually be a sign of a threat. Also, you might have bad breath and, you know, they don't like it. Coming to a sleeping dog and trying to kiss him is actually even a higher risk than kissing the dog that is aware that you're coming to them because a sleeping dog will be more likely to you know, get surprised by you coming and kissing him all of a sudden. I mean, it's kind of a rude awakening. Some dogs do like kissing. I don't know if they like the kissing because they think it's something good, like we think it is, or because they think it's something like licking, for example. And dogs will do a la grooming, which is basically grooming another dog in order to strengthen the bond or to show that nobody is in danger. So if you're planning to kiss your dog, you first need to see if your dog is comfortable with you getting very close to him or if they're comfortable with you touching them or getting your face close to them. You should definitely learn some body language in dogs to know when they're actually showing signs of stress. Signs of stress sometimes might be very small things and not just growling and showing teeth. Even yawning or lip licking can be a sign of stress. And if your dog doesn't like being kissed, don't kiss him. Oh, by the way, if you do kiss him, you don't need to wear red lipstick because dogs actually can't see red. Oh, you didn't know that? So check out this video.